Hi everyone. Well, I got the Yu-Gi-Oh! The Art of the Cards book, and I got this Saturday night, so here's the front of it, and it is hardback. Here's the back, and the spine. This is, I, I like it, um, I like the book. I just wish they did not stick the alternate artwork in it because I do not really like the alternate artwork. I'm more of the anime style art, but that is just my opinion. Some of the artwork is okay, but I still prefer the original from the anime. And here are the arts from each of the cards. So the and it tells you somewhere. Oh, uh right here. It'll say which duelist used the card, which if you want to do character deck builds, that would help. Like this one is the duelist who used it as Yugi's is Yugi. So yeah, it it's really good, but I do have the other book, uh, the dual. I think it's dual illustration book by Kazuki Takahashi, and for me, I prefer that book. That's just my personal favorite because it has more of the art from Kazuki in it. Hey, Shadow. <laughs> That's my cat. Um, but I'm going to try and do this a little quick because I am trying to pack up. I am moving because I'm getting married. Here is the Blue Eyes White Dragon that I like. The This one is, eh, that one's kind of so-so and this one's kind of, in my head, what were they thinking? That's kind of what's going through my head, but I prefer this artwork. Book of Sacred Arts, a Yugi card, Brain Control, Yugi, um, Buster Bladers, Yugi. But yeah, the, the book is, itself is okay. I am glad I got it, but I wish they kind of, again, like I said, did not stick the alternate artwork in it because for me, why mess with a good thing? I know you want to upgrade and make it fresh, but mm -mm. to me, just stick with what the anime has. Again, personal opinion, personal preference. Dark Hole is actually a banned card, if I'm not mistaken. So if you want to do tournaments, uh, don't use it. But if you want to do character decks and do accuracy, you can put it in there. At least that's my personal opinion. This is my favorite art for Dark Magician. I do have a statue of this card, and I do have this exact painting of it. So what I mean by that is I don't have the blue Dark Magician, or what I call the Smurf Dark Magician. So we got that one, and there's Dark Magician Girl. I have this card and this. This artwork's kind of so-so. Same with that one, but I prefer this one. Let's see, Dark Zebra, Dark Witch... D-spell. It's just... I like how this is a little thick and not papery. It's like the glossy paper, so that is a good thing. I do like it that way. It's not as... it doesn't seem as flimsy. So that's good. Uh, Dust Tornado, Yugi used it. Ectoplasm, Bakora, and Arcana used it. And let me backtrack just for a minute. Um, I think they put the red dark, yes they did, the red dark magicians in there, that's what Arcana used, that one's okay, so, um, exchange, eradicating aerosol, Feral Imp and all this. I mean, they have all the cards listed from the anime, so. I think this book would actually help if people want to do a character deck profile for the anime. I actually, that's my, what I use, that might be what I use this book for when I'm ready to do the character builds for the, what I call the non-important characters. Um. 
So like I said, I'm sorry I'm going a little fast. I just want to show the book before I pack it. That was shown in season four. That was only played once in season one by Yugi. Season two by Weevil and again by Joey because he played it in the finals. But I think, yeah, they, they had Joey because he did play it in the finals in Battle City. Oh. The downside, these, pitch, these pages stick. King's Knight by Yuki, Season 2. Komori Dragon, season one, and two, I think. That is a weird reprint of Karibo. I like this one better. Exodia. Thank God they did not do a reprint of Exodia. Magic Arm Shield, Magical Hats, They, when they printed this card in TCG, they put it as a trap, but it's really a magic card. I have these two cards, actually I have this, these three cards, um, and I probably have some others somewhere else, I just, I have over, I think, 600 cards. Mahavilo, Taya played it. Makiyu, Yugi played it. Marsh Macaron, again, that was Yugi. Do I think you guys should go buy this? If you like Yu-Gi-Oh! and you want to support it, I would say yes. But if you had to choose between this book and the other book, I, I love this trap card, um, Mirror Force. I would pick the other art book because it, it's actually art from the creator, Kazuki Takahashi. So, but this book is still good. I mean, there's nothing wrong with the book. I just wish they had pictures of the duelists that played them. But, you know, it's living up to its name. Dragon played by Pegasus in season one. Right there. I like this polymerization because it's from the anime. That one's okay. I like this red eyes art. I don't know. Do they? I wonder if they have. I'll have to find it. Um, I'm gonna see if they have the the Egyptian gods in here. I'm not sure if they do. Salamandra, Sage of Stone, which is Yugi's. Soggy, which is Kaiba's. Scapegoat. I'm just kind of skimming it. Gold Eyes, that was played by Joey. Okay, so they do have the Egyptian gods in here. There was Slifer, that was played by Strings and Yugi. I think Spell Shattering Arrow took the place of Living Arrow.
that was played by the Paradox Brothers in season one. Eye of Truth was played by Yugi only one time in season one when he dueled Kaiba. Blue Dragon of Ra. I think I skipped Obelisk, but he's in here. If the other two are in here, then he's in here. Tragedy. Tragedy wasn't played by Arcana, but he did have it in, in his hand. Wabaku was played by Taya. Jeez. Watapon was played by Yugi in the Yu-Gi-Oh! movie. Here's some more of the art. Time Wizard, Buster Blader, or Black Luster Soldier, Time Wizard, Baby Dragon, Karibo, Summon Skull, I think? Yeah, Summon Skull. Okay. Why they picked the crappy Dark Magician, I don't know. And this is the book I like, Dual Art, by Kazuki Takahashi. And there is the Yu-Gi-Oh! Art of the Cards book. If you have any questions, please feel free to comment on the video. Again, sorry if I went too fast. I'm trying to get this done before I move. So, again, please comment on the video, and I'll see you later, Dulles. Bye-bye.